Carl! You're a fucking hero down in that list. I just spoke to my cousin. Not with my people, I ain't. Shit's still fucked up. Man, I got homies I used to run with that turn they back on me over this. Yeah, well, what are you gonna do, huh? Fucking Ryder, man. That was my homie. And I killed him. Fucking midget deserved it, eh? Little asshole tried to bang your sister, you know that? No. For real? Shit. Maybe you right then, man, but... Cheer the fuck up! You're going soft on me, man. You did something good, eh? Yes, you did. But this isn't over yet. What you mean? Well, your former friends have a factory. And the way I see it, if you take that out, you will have put them out of business for good. Yeah. CJ. Who was this? I work for Woozy. He told me to call you. I will suck. I'm rigging a car with explosives so you can take out the crack factory. Drop around the garage downtown. Cool. I'll be at you in a minute. Alright, bro, let's go ahead and do this. Don't sweat. Go ahead and get this um this car. <clears throat> I do remember this this mission. This is the one where we actually blow up the crack factory and stuff. This is where you gotta blow up the um, the whole entire crack factory and all that though, bro. But again, man, shout out to y'all, man. I really appreciate all the love and support y'all been showing on this series. I ain't gonna lie, this game has a lot of issues, but I have in, been enjoying playing this a whole lot. <laughs> I have been enjoying playing this a whole lot. I do apologize if my voice sound a little raspy or whatever. I just got done streaming. Y'all know what I do, man. I stream, then I get right to the recording, man. I'm a workaholic when it come down to this YouTube stuff, bro. No cap. Let's go ahead and get to this spot, bro. Go ahead and holler, holler at my guy Woozy. Well, not my Woozy, but Woozy's Connect, I guess you would call him. Hey, man, is it ready? She's all set. Get in. She's packing enough to take out that crack lab. I've wired in a delay timer to give you time to get out. Cool. Good luck. Do y'all see that it say time bomb, time bomb on the license plate? Like it said on the front and the back. That's insane. That's funny as crap. All right, here we go. Let's go. I don't know if you're not supposed to crash this a lot. If you crash it a lot, will it blow up? I don't really remember, but I ain't finna try to crash it no way. Just in case that is true, we're gonna try to be careful on the way to this damn crack factory, bro. No cap. We're gonna try to be careful on the way. All right, guys. Here we go. Kill the guards. That will give. That will get their attention. Holy crap! I didn't even try to use that, but all right. Being hit. Get out there and kill the fool. All right. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go ahead and kill all these dudes right here, like out here. Let me go ahead and kill all these dudes real quick. Crap! I got the cops on me. The cops love to come and mess up something, like, they really truly do. I might actually die, no cap. Yeah. Holy crap, let me hurry up and get back in this car. Ah, oh, I died. All right, let's pretend that last part didn't happen. Let's go ahead and get into the car and just drive into the crack shop, into the crack, into the crack lab. Cause yo, the, the cops will mess up anything, I promise you. They will mess up anything, bro, in this game. They don't let you free for nothing. Like, they so annoying. You gotta be like, bro, don't wanna like you. I'm so glad this damn car don't explode on impact. Cause that would have been bad. All right, here we go. We pulling up. Shit, I'm so fried, I'm seeing shit. I'm so fried, I'm seeing shit, I'm dead. I bet you is. Get out of the warehouse before the timer runs out. Holy crap. All right, I'm, I'm going with the K this time. I ain't even for a lot to you. Okay, we need to be hurrying up and getting up out of here. Run, Joe, run. Run, Joe, run. Okay, we out of there. Let's go. Holy crap. Escape out the main gate. Wait. We low, CJ. All right, come on. Can I get a drink from here? Let's see, because I need health so bad. Please tell me I get a drink out of here. 
Please. No, are you telling me I can't get a drink? Wow, that's crazy. All right. Well, we got to be careful. Maybe, maybe I can get a drink out of the other one. Let's see. Hold up. Hold up. We're going to try something, bro. Because I don't want to do all this and then I die. Because holy crap. I should have had some body armor when I pulled up. Crap. Can't get no drink. Oh, well. Hopefully, we'll just not die then. Let's just try our best not to freaking die. Let's get down. Let's pull out the K. Holy crap, dude. Where you at? There we go. Got him. Put him down. Put him right down. Come on. Bro, I literally have no health. Like, none. My health is non-existent, dude. Are you serious? Don't I get a bike or something? Like, how the hell do I get out of here? Holy crap, bro. I'm finna die. I'm finna for sure die. Look at those dudes right there. Okay, he did. Was it anybody else in that car? Holy crap, I don't know. Now you better shut up. Yeah. Dude right there is in the car. I was gonna say, hurry up and die before you shoot me and I die. Dave shut the gate. I remember this being a bike or something. I don't really remember this being no car. Maybe I'm tripping though. Watch out. Watch out. Yeah, watch out. Yeah. What if I failed that? I for sure did. Holy crap, dude. I knew it. I was like, what if I failed that whole entire jump? And that's exactly what I did. Why would they give me the little cutscene and everything? Like I did something great. Oh no, the car's on fire. Oh my God. What? All right, guys, let's try this again, man. We is out of here. I still have no health. Hopefully we can get gone. Let's go. Get back to the garage. Holy crap, bro. Y'all just don't know what I went through with that mission. I kept getting stuck on all this type of invisible crap. Man, I'm telling y'all, bro, the stuff that y'all believe is wrong with this game. Like, the, if I tell y'all what I went through, y'all wouldn't even believe me, bro. Like, I went through BS with this entire game, bro. No cap. There we go. 25,000. Holy crap, dude. Speak on it. This is a friend of yours. I've got some information relating to your brother. Come to my ranch and I'll explain. If in Chiara Robota cross the Garber Bridge, head south. Who the fuck is this? I can't talk right now. Get your ass over here. Mom's always told me not to talk to strangers. And look what happened to the bitch. Now if you want your brother to go to sleep tonight with his tongue intact, get your ass over here. Goodbye. Welcome. So fucking welcome, man. What you know about my family? Now first we need to see what you're made of. What it look like I'm made of? Putin? No, anger and hate. And that's what I like about you. Hey, there's a truck in the garage. I say we take it for a spin. Here's the deal. This is all about speed and commitment. You got GPS in the cab. Get to each set of the map coordinates as quick as you can. Make it to all the coordinates, then get the truck back here, lose the truck, and you fail. First, what's the GPS? Second, fail what? And third, who the fuck are you? Sorry. Need to know basis only. Oh, one more thing. This baby's got four-wheel steering instead of a handbrake. Good luck. All right, get in the monster truck. I remember this mission. Man, I've been dreading this mission for so long, bro. Because, man, this mission right here is crazy bogus. If you mess the truck up, flip it, destroy it, or anything, it's over with. Then the messed up part is, why do it have to rain in my game? Like, why does it have to rain right now, bro? Like, come on, dude. But here we go. We're going to try my best. You got to get a... Uh, uh, a time of 6.30 or better, which isn't hard to hit. It's not a hard to hit time. It's just, holy crap, bro. And then the fact that it's raining right now, man, that's mad bogus. I feel like I'm being sold right now. But Rockstar did put out a patch 
I don't know what the patch did because the game is still mad broken. Like that last mission with the crack lab, I kept I kept blowing the car up because it kept getting stuck on like invisible debris. I guess all the old debris from when I first blew it up was still technically there. And it was just it just kept it just kept catching on fire and blowing up, so I don't know dude. The game is still like broken. Bad as crap. The rain is still like whoa, it's still bad. It ain't as bad as it was, but it's still bad. Like it's still hard as crap to see. They need to completely redo the rain altogether. I wouldn't mind them bringing back the old rain if that's the case. Because this rain is terrible. It's very bad, but oh well. I'm seeming to be I'm seeming to be managing alright, so we ain't gonna worry about it. We are not going to worry about it. Again, dude, guys, I was gonna say dudes. <laughs> Again, bro, I, I do apologize if my voice sound kinda like strenuous or woe out. I did just get through streaming. If y'all wanna know a time frame of what's going on, I just got done streaming the RDR1 stream. So, boom. If y'all watch that, then y'all know exactly when I'm recording. I'm recording this Im immediately. Like, as soon as I ended that stream, I just straight switched over to my video editing um, version of OBS and started um, recording. <laughs> I just immediately started recording, bro. Not even, not even no joke. Not even no joke, bro. Again, man, I do appreciate y'all, man, coming out through the streams, supporting the videos. Like I said in stream, man, I really do love y'all a lot, bro. I'm not finna get all mushy gushy in this damn video, but I mean what I say, bro. Y'all mean a lot to me. Y'all really do. Y'all mean the world to a, to a G like me. You know what I'm saying? But let's go ahead and continue this. Go and knock these out. Hopefully, I can get this time. I mean, I'm at 236, 237. I'm making pretty good time, I think. I got 21 out of the 35 check, checkpoints. Holy shit. That was almost bad. The rain starting to kick up now. It's starting to get hard as crap to see. Like, I want to know, do y'all see what I see? Do y'all notice how bad the rain is in this game? Or is it just me? Is it just because I'm playing it and I'm seeing it firsthand? Like, does it look that bad on the videos? Because playing this game with this rain is, man, it's so bad. It's so very bad. Like, extremely bad. All right, bro, we got, what, nine more checkpoints to go? Here we go. Let's go ahead and get on the road. Play it safe. We ain't gonna do too much craziness. Do too much craziness. All right, let's slow it down here. Get that checkpoint. I'm guessing the next checkpoint. Oh my God. Holy crap, I thought I was gonna run into that gas tank and blow myself up. Holy crap. All right, here we go. Here we go. Hey, I ain't managed to flip it over yet, so I'm happy about that so far. I ain't managed to flip it over yet. So what, we got five more checkpoints to go. I think the fifth checkpoint is the very last checkpoint you gotta get. I don't think you have to get the rest of the checkpoints. I don't think you have to actually take it back yourself. I think the last checkpoint is the actual, you know, going back destination. So here we go, we got this checkpoint. Two more checkpoints to go. We got this one. Boom. And bam. Yeah, I figured so. Bringing it back, man. Let's bring it home. Oh, man. I thought I was going to mess it up at the end. Let's go, though. Okay, so I didn't come in first, but I was shortly second. Good for a ghetto boy. The boss will be in touch. Did he just call me a ghetto boy? And I only got four thousand dollars for that. Come on, bro. That sucks. Who the fuck is this? Son, get back to the ranch, and I'll explain everything. And I mean everything. Can't you just tell me now? I guess not. All right, we are already here, so let's go ahead and see who this is. Like I said, I know who this is, but let's go. Hey, Carl. Hey, what the fuck, man? Hey, Torino, I, I told you my bad, man. What the hell can I say? I screwed you Calm over. Calm down, kid. Just go ahead and kill me then. Calm down. Man, you ain't number the fucking Yale dealer anyway, Torino. Shut up and sit down. What, you think I'm a drug dealer? 
And what, you think you're a crusader for good? Do you have any idea what's going on? Any idea whatsoever? Do you? Do you? Nah, I pay as little attention to things as possible. Do not be a fucking smartass with me. I work for a government agency. It is not important which one. I will try not to confuse you. Yes, when we last met, I was involved in battling threats in Latin America by any means necessary. That does not make me a drug dealer. Now, the money that we raised, the friends that we won over, have helped us immeasurably in our overseas interests. Government agency? Kids like you, you expect heroes. We're fighting a war out there. I'll be a hero and I'll lose. And what do we have? Communism in Ohio. People sharing. Nobody buying stuff. That kind of bullshit. So relax and listen. All right, all right. I'm listening. I know what kind of guy you are. I need a guy like you. To do things I can't get caught doing. Like what? I need you to commandeer a truck. A rival agency with a confused social agenda. They got things that we need. Now, this is a two-man job. You'll need a friend. Use your sister's boyfriend, but don't tell him a thing. Remember, I'll be watching you. I got here as fast as I could, CJ. Yeah, you sure did. How you know I needed help? <laughs> Man, you losing it, Holmes. You phoned me a half hour ago. I did? I mean, oh, yeah, I did. Sorry, man, I got a whole lot on my mind. All right, bro, here we go. Let's get on this bike. That boy CJ then got involved with we the need to government. Check the on the freeway. It's headed to San Fierro. All right, we need to hijack this truck on this freeway. Can I put a waypoint on it? Where is the truck? Let me see. You know what? I see it right here. Yeah, let's see. Let's see if I can put a waypoint on it. Maybe that'll work. We'll see, though. We shall see. I don't think I needed to put it on there, but just in case. I do remember this mission, though. This the one was CJ, not CJ, we but Caesar. Gotta jump to the, um, gotta jump on the, 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 the truck. Kind of like, it kind of like a, a, a remembrance of that mission with Michael and Franklin. When um the guy stole Michael boat. <laughs> What's the plan? I'm gonna pull alongside and you gonna hop aboard. Oh shit, you didn't mention that on the phone. It'll be a walk in the park. Tell Kendall I love her. Hey, that's real love. That boy said, Tell Kendall I love her. I know that's real, my dude. There's a rig up ahead. Oh, that boy on the move too. Holy shit. I wonder can I get this? Well, I was gonna say first try. I think you only jump off when you get it. All right, let's go. Speed up, CJ. Get on it. Get on it. Come on. Keep level, CJ. Keep level. Closer, CJ. Closer. Come on, fool. What do you think my Mexican jump it being closer? Oh, my closer, God. CJ, see. Closer. Come on, CJ. Oh, my God. I'm under the car. There we go. I mean, under the closer, truck. Closer, CJ. Closer. There we go. Let's go. Finally, he got it. All right, I'm going to let him do his thing. Because he's going to continue to crash all into me. There we go. Get into the truck and drive it back to the garage. There we go. Let's go, C's. That boy clutching the... That boy, I'm telling you. That boy C's clutching the fourth. Let's go, man. Deliver to the truck back to the garage. Let's go, boo. That wasn't too bad. I thought C's okay, was going to sell the bag, though. Back to the garage. I for sure thought he was gonna see the bag. Like, come on, fool. Shit. I was there long enough for you to for you to do what you gotta do, bro. But all right, bro, we're gonna go ahead. I'm gonna take it all the way down and turn it around. Just so I have no type of issues. Dang. Cause in this game, if you lose the tank the tanker, you actually fail the mission. You actually fail the mission if you lose the tanker. Alright guys, here we go, man. Finally they made it. Got the cops on me and everything, but it is what it is. Let's go. 7,000. That boy Torino don't pay nothing. 
My boy need his head. What is wrong with guy? Here. Now. Don't screw around. What an asshole. Roger that, big monkey. I got a 13-6 fat vulture. Need to acquire a drowning baby. Over. What? In 15 by the fat moon. Break your heart. Over and out. Carl, I need you to do me a favor. Yeah, I'll do you a proper injury, man. What you knowing about my brother? <laughs> Relax. He's in prison upstate. D-wing, cell 13. To the left, I got a child killer who wants to rip his throat out. To the right of him, I got a white supremacist who wants to eat his heart, to be precise. Now, don't worry. Tenpenny and Pulaski are really relatively benign, unless, of course, you're a family member of Officer Pendleberry, whom they shot when he threatened to expose them, but you do know all about that, right? <laughs> Damn! Hey, man, how you know all this stuff, man? And won't you stop it? You just don't understand, do you, kid? Look, it's all white knights and heroes. We have to make decisions, kid. You know, I try to set bad people on other bad people, and sometimes I let good guys die. He's your brother, but to me, he's just collateral. It's a very delicate decision. Over here, you got all the scumbags inside the country. And over here, you got all the scumbags outside the country. And me and my colleagues, we're the fucking pivot. Keep the government in work. Which reminds me, come here, okay? I need you to head over here in the buggy outside, okay? Okay, let off a flare. We got some precious cargo needs collected. Hey, hold up. What about my brother and all that shit you was talking hey, about? Hey, don't worry. Sweet's just fine. He gets touched. A prison guard goes home and finds that his wife and kid have been murdered. Everything's under control. We'll talk later. Now, come on, get out of here. That boy Torino the real deal, bro. That boy know everything going on. No kizzy. Where's my car that I parked there? Here we go. That boy really know everything going on. My thing, though, a question I always had about this game is if Torino knows so much, right? If he know that Tim Penny and Pulaski is really like cricket cops and they doing all this stuff to CJ and just a bunch of other people, why don't he never stop it? Like, you know what I mean? I know he kind of, I know. Whoa! What the hell? <laughs> that damn cat was flying. But again, like that, that always tripped me out because like I used to always ask that question, like, why don't he ever stop it? And I know he kind of he kind of explained it a little bit to CJ. Like he got all the scumbags inside of the state or inside the country. Then he got all the scumbags outside the country. And he got to like balance it out. But like that just always tripped me out because it's like, yo, you can do something. You know what I'm saying? For helping you instead of, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, he gets sweet out of jail and stuff, but like, can't you like also got Pulaski and Tim Penny out of there too? Or can't you like got them locked up or something? You know what I'm saying? But that's just my take on That's just something I always thought about when I played this game. All right, here we go. Jesus, what took you? Torino, where you at? Miles away. No time for niceties, kid. Choose a vehicle, grab the equipment I provided, get to that drop zone, and wait for that package. Got this RPG. All right, I'm I'm gonna use the bike. I think it's always just more used, more uh, you know what I'm saying, just easier to take the dirt bike up here than any other other thing, especially the ATV. The ATV suck. I can see you taking the Bandito up there before you taking before you take the uh, the ATV. If you take the ATV up here, you a mad man. Like you have really lost your cranium cap. Like I ain't even finna lie to you. I think I remember this one though. I think this the one where all the government agents gonna fly in and stuff. I hope I don't die on this. Cause I definitely didn't get no body armor at all. So I might actually die a few times on this mission. No cap. But we gonna see though. Maybe I won't die. We're gonna test it out. Jesus, will you stop doing that? Hold up! Shit, pilot says he's got trouble. Two agency choppers coming in on an intercept. Can you see them? Yeah. Shoot them down! 
protect the cargo at all costs. All right. Well, I already had this out anyway. All right, let's see. Crap. 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 Come on, yo. That's crazy. Where is this? Uh, Where are the helicopters? Where the helicopters at? Here we go. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, whoa. It landed on me and did major damage. Let me run out the way. Because it was going to just do way too much damage on me. I lost half of my health. Holy crap, at least it's a health box right there. Let's go, dudes. All right, I'm going to wait for that one to stop somewhere. Slow it down. Slow it down. Come on. There we go. Let me move out the way again before it blow up on me. See, look. Like, it do damage to me. That's crazy. Holy crap. All right, let me, let me get out the way again. Let me get out the way again. Cause crap, dude. This mission actually pretty crazy. And the heli is taking a lot of damage. There we go. Slap out of the sky. Let's go, boys. And girls. <laughs> All right, get the country band. I don't even know if I need this parachute. Maybe not. I don't even think I need it. Let's go ahead and get back on the bike. Yeah, I don't even need that, that parachute. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. No, I don't think I did. I mean, I'm pretty sure you probably could do something sick, like drive up that and then parachute all the way down. Holy crap. Are you serious? I got the cops on me. What do the cops need with me, bro? Why? Why? Come on, let's pull off. Skirt. I mean, I did just kill a bunch of... Uh, I'm guessing they were some type of agents. I don't know. But I'm just going to call them agents. You know, I did just kill a bunch of agents. So, you know, they would kind of get the cops on you, Tia. You know what I mean? Oh, crap. CJ, you stop selling the bag, my boy. What is this area? What is this all the way out here? Yo, I might have to come back here and explore this. Wait, let's see what this is. What is this? It's just a random store just, just out here? It's just this is like a random grocery store out here. That's funny. I want to know, does it open? Is it an open store? Do people really shop there? You got your local, your local neighborhood Walmart just sitting there in the middle of nowhere. Just out there like... <laughs> hey, that's pretty funny. Just got your late... Your, your local neighborhood Walmart. I can't talk today. Like, what the world is wrong with me? Here we go. We driving. We driving. I ain't worried about the cops, though. They ain't on nothing. The cops ain't on Squad Jack, Dilly. All right. Here we go. Got the bag. Wait, did I have to get out of the car? Maybe I did. That's a big old bag. Okay. Get the package back to Las Brujas. Where are you? You giving me the heebie-jeebies, man. Carl, I will always be watching or listening or both. All right, bro. Deliver the contraband to the hideout. Let's go ahead and take this back for my boy Torino. All right, they made it to the drop-off location. Let's go ahead and drop that off. Let's go. One thousand dollars, bro. This boy Torino pay shit. What is wrong with my dude, bro? He is mad bogus. It's amazing. What's up now, Torino? This history—it's all lies. It says Hitler killed himself, and then we nuked Japan. And people believe this shit. Jesus. Well, if it makes them sleep better at night, I guess. Hey, man, what did you want? Is you gonna free my brother? No. Not now. And here's a little news flash. I said that to get you to do something for me. Man, you real fucked up. But the shocker is, we are gonna look after him. Because I need him alive as much as you do. Oh, thanks. You know, after what you've done for me, it's like you're a pro now. I got double agents in Panama. I want to put a price on your head. A Russian spy. Little fat Boris looking guy. He's asking for clearance to interrogate you. Russian style. Calipers on the genitals. Feels good. You'd like it. That ain't nothing cool, man. Just leave me alone. You bad news. Don't worry about it. The Russians got bigger things to worry about than your genitals, believe me. The whole country went to shit. You know, we tried hard to put a lid on it, 
But that idiot Gorbachev with his little strawberry on his forehead, he gave away the crown jewels. Still, they got their, you know, their boy in the White House. That was nice. So? What you want me to do? Now listen, I need you to buy me some property, okay? Shouldn't cost that much. You offer them a dollar. If they give you a hard time, kill them. I'm gonna need you to start doing some real wet work here for me soon, okay? Enough of this little girl bullshit. Now get out of here. Come on, beat it. Go to the abandoned airstrip and buy. Oh shit. Yeah, this is that part. We gotta buy the abandoned airstrip. Holy crap, I'm losing muscle. All right, guys, we done finally made it out here. We just about got the right amount of money to buy this, bro. We just $14,000 above, bro. I was worried we, we weren't going to have enough. I thought it was going to be like um, 100000 but we got it, bro. So let's go ahead and buy this. Let's go, boys. We got our ourselves our own little airstrip. That's what I'm talking about. So what do you think of our new base of operations? It's missing something. Maybe a tennis court and a pool will help motivate me better. Very nice call, very cute. Uh, so listen, now, <clears throat> you're gonna have to learn how to fly. No, I ain't. Yes, actually you are. I set out a series of tests for you. You can access them on that TV. You're gonna have to prove to me that you can fly if you're gonna continue working towards your brother's freedom. Shit, whatever, man. Very nice. Holy crap, bro. The flight missions. Man, come on, dude. And we got the damn snow, the damn sandstorm that messed up everything. Holy crap, bro. I got to learn how to fly. Jesus H. Christ. This is, this is AIDS. <laughs> All right, guys. So we got these damn flight missions and stuff. I ain't know if I, I might not show all of these. I'm just might show like the first one or two just to prove it and all that. Just to just show off, you know, some of the flight in this game. Holy crap. But y'all know, man, in these games, the flying is terrible. The flying is just as bad as anywhere, any other game. All right, descend to the next Corona ring. Holy crap, bro, the flight is so bad. It's so wiggly. <laughs> Holy crap, it's so wiggly. There we go, bro, 88%. How did I not get 100% on that? All right, let's go ahead and try to land this thing. We're gonna go ahead and try to land it without death. Without death. Come on. There we go. Here we go. We gotta stop in the target zone. I think so. Holy crap. Even driving it back and forth like this is terribly. And I mean terribly. There we go, though. 96%. Can't be mad at that. Now they want you, boy, to go counter or clockwise. I think this is, yeah, they got me trying to go clockwise. Holy crap, dude. This actually got machine guns on it. That's funny. That is funny to me. The plane got machine guns on it. What type of, where, where would I be needing machine guns for on this plane? I hope I don't have to shoot anything, because that's over with. That is so done. I am not doing it. I won't be able to do it. Yo, the flying feel weird. It feel worse than what I remember. Like really worse. It feel bad. Like it feel like really bad. Like holy crap, dude. No! Crap. There we go, guys. I went on ahead and cut all throughout, throughout the whole entire flying stuff. It wasn't nothing, man. It was actually pretty hard. Um, the plane parts was actually pretty hard. And the um, having to destroy the two moving vehicles, it didn't take me, it took me only one try, but hey, I got it now. Hello? Carl, it's Woozy. Hey, Woozy, man, what you been up to? Come along and see for yourself. I got a little business proposition for you. Come over and see the setup, my friend. Okay, for sure, I like that. Like it? You're gonna love it. It's the Four Dragons Casino in Las Venturas. I'll see you soon, yeah? Yeah, okay. All right, guys. With that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. When we come back, man, we're going to finally be in my favorite part of the game, man. Las Venturas, that's my favorite part of the game, bro. I love that part, man. 
But as always, any and all support y'all dropping this video is highly appreciated. Like, comment, subscribe if you're new. And as always, be easy. Take care. This video was an hour and 20 minutes recording. I'm going to see how long it is once I edit it.